So today we are in the Shakri Sanctum, which is the climax of episode four, and we're shooting these scenes with Amy, Rory, the Doctor, Brian, and also Stephen Burkoff as the Shakri. The human contagion only must be eliminated. Very easy to write in a load of cubes in a script, but then the brilliant art department here have to make them and strew them all around the world. It's a very simple idea, but uh, quite complicated. They cut that. Earlier today, Douglas was showing me some, uh, some cut footage of some of the scenes they did in the unit base. We welcome unit back. It was nice for me to get a bit of unit action. You know? Kit Stewart is the new head of unit. Sorry about the raucous entrance. She is the daughter of a well-known member of the cast from Classic Doctor Who. 24 hours, we had to check it out, and uh, the dogs do love a run out. I love the little thing that Chris has done, a little nod to the past. Brigadier Lesbridge Stewart, who uh, Doctor Who fans will know from many, many unit stories. He guided me, even to the end. Science leads, he always told me. He said he'd learnt that from an old friend. If you do know the history, I think that there's just something really beautiful about um, what he's done with Gemma Redgrave's character and, um, and, you know, who her dad was. What a cool little mystery there. She's so self-assured and she's got this really, like, amazing voice, which is, that's a terrible impression, don't show her that. <laughs> it's such an honour to be part of this incredible tradition and extraordinarily written and produced series. Mark Williams has done such a great job as Rory's dad and, and we had a great time with him in episode two and it was always planned to bring him back. What he's great at, he's, he can do the fun and the warmth but he's also it's got a lot of pathos in that performance and uh, I love that partnership of him and him and Arthur. I, I just buy them as father and son. Brian's log. Day 67. You, uh, you, you can't call it that. Brian's log. I was so pleased when Mark got the part. I've been a fan of his for years. He's so much fun. And watching him in the show, he's a complete master of what he does. <laughs> It's the end of a trio, and it just felt to me this trio has been incredibly powerful. And the link uh, between the idea of something being cubed and meaning to the power of three just felt was a really nice thing that came to me when I was writing it.